Hi guys, Tech James here. In this video, I will be showing you guys how to get the Easy RPG Player on your PS Vita or PS TV. So basically, what this does, it's kind of like an emulator that lets you play the RPG Maker 2000 and 2003 games. So if you don't know what these games are, they're basically custom games that people made. Um, so you can get Zelda ones, Pokemon ones, um, completely like random ones. People make their own custom games. If you guys want to get this and this is something you're interested in, go ahead and just open it up Vita shell when Vita show loads just press select connect your PS Vita to your PC and I will show you guys what's to do next okay guys so over on your PC I will leave all the links in the description to set up the easy RPG player so the first link we will need to get the VPK and the data file for the application itself so scroll down just click on download VPK and also click on download data files okay so once we've got these two files and they have finished downloading we will need to go to the next link in the description this is where we need to choose the games for the emulator so go to the game section up here go to full game list now on the full game list there are two types of engines we can use on this we can use 2000 and 2003 so it's these two right here rpg maker 2000 and rpg maker 2003 2000 um they're slightly older they're not as good so i'd probably select the 2003 one so just click on this and then just click on apply now we just need to find our roms so there's plenty of pages plenty of different ones um there's some like kind of like Zelda ones on here as well and like this Zelda one as well you guys can pretty much scroll through and find anything you want um, I've actually already downloaded a copy of this one and I'm also going to download a copy of this just to test it out and um, yeah you can pretty much just scroll through and just find anything you want and um, once you actually have found a game you want what you have to do it will just look like this on pretty much every game you just want to look for the download section right here so click on downloads and from there you'll be able to just click download and the file should start downloading okay so once we have got our RPG maker games what we want to do from here is just go to our downloads folder and we will be able to find all of the files in here so the first thing we want to do get the VPK file drag and drop that onto the root of our PS Vita once that's on there we can delete that from our downloads folder next get the easy RPG.zip file right click and select extract here once that's extracted, we can actually delete the zip file. We do not need that anymore. Now for your games, I would recommend double clicking on them and just checking what kind of format they're in. So as you can see, this one we would have to do extract to and in the file folder. And then with this game we just downloaded, we can right click and just do extract here. And now with your games, select both the files and you want to put them inside of the Easy RPG Player folder. So just drag and drop them across. And the games should look exactly like this. It actually comes with a test game and um, that's a game you can just use to make sure it works. So what we can do from here, go onto our PS Vita, go into the data folder and just drag and drop this whole folder across into the data folder. So that is literally it for the PC. We've now got the VPK and we're copying the games across right now. So I'm just going to wait two minutes wait for this all to copy across and then when it's done i'll go back onto my ps vita and i will show you guys what to do next okay so when we're back let's go onto our uxo let's scroll all the way down and we're looking for the easy rpg player vpk file so press x and then x again to install it and then it should start installing so it shouldn't take long so just give it a couple of seconds to install and now once it's done, we can just close out of each shell and find the application on our home screen. So here it is, the Easy RPG Player. So what we're going to do, we're just going to tap on it and then just tap on Start. So what it's going to do, it's going to load in like this. We can actually press R on our PS Vita to change the screen size. So you can have it stretched um, like normal, slightly bigger. I think stretched is probably pretty good. We're going to press X on games. And then we've got several games here. These are the games that I copied across. So it's very simple. All you do is press X to load up your game. Obviously, this is the one it comes with. This is Test Game 2000. I don't really know what this is, so I'm going to select one of the ones that I got. I got this game right here, never played it before, let's just press X to load it up. So sometimes the games do take a while to load, maybe like a minute. So um, as you can see this one's a bit quicker, but if they're taking a while to load, all you have to do is just simply wait for it. 
So these are what the games are like, basically RPG games, they look like Pokemon games. As I said, there are actually some Pokemon games you can get. Um, I couldn't actually find any, to be honest, on the website, so there's probably some out there. I have seen like an Eevee one or something like that. But yeah, these are the type of games, RPG games, where you kind of like walk around and you have to, you know, do things. And um, yeah, there's plenty of cool games on here. I did actually see a really cool Zelda one. I probably should have got that. But yeah, this one is um, quite interesting as well. So yeah, that is pretty much it for this video. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next one.